everyone and welcome back to my channel here. Today what we're going to be doing is Wonderwall by Oasis. Let's get into it. So guys, for the verse what we're going to need are four chords. We need uh, E minor, G, D and A. But they're variations on the chord. So E minor, you hold your a, uh, E minor as normal. So it's the A string and the D string in box two. And in box three, it's the little B and E strings in the third box. So we're gonna call that E minor add nine. So you have your normal E minor shape, and then these two little fingers in box three on little B and E. Now we're gonna leave those two little fingers on the whole time for this verse. They stay there and don't move. It's only gonna be your first two fingers that will move around on the guitar. So that's your E minor. Now the strumming for E minor, I want you to count to four and then at the end do an and. So it goes one, two, three, four, and. The down up at the end, the last down up, is the exact same timing as just one strum on the um, other section. So the first three strums goes one, two, three, and the last two strums, the down up together, take that same amount of timing, but there's two strums. So instead of going down, up, you have to go down, up on the same um, beat. So we're gonna to count to four and then do an up at the end. It goes one, two, three, four, and. Then we're into our full G. So again, those two little fingers stay on. Second box, uh, A string, and third box, big E string. Now the first two strums are split, so that's a down up, so it's one and. Same as just one strum, so it's one and, two, three, four and. So one and, two, three, four and. Then you're into that D sus4. Now, if you know D sus4, great. If not, it's a regular D with your pinky finger on the little string E, um, box three. So again, that's just like the G that we did. Uh, it goes one and two, three, four and. One and two, three, four and. Now that's a normal D sus4, but the way I play it is I take off my first finger and I replace him with my middle finger. So now my middle finger's on G2, and then those two little fingers are on. That's how I play the D sus4. And then I switch to my A sus4. Now, there's two ways of playing this. You can just add on your first finger to the D string from where you are in that D sus4, uh, or you can uh, remove your middle finger as well. So you can do um, second box, D and G, as well as the other two little fingers. Or you can make it more distinct from the D by removing that middle finger. So you only have box two D string and then the other two little fingers on B and E in box three. And that's how I play it. And for that one, it's just down up four times. One and two and three and four and. So we have that E minor starting off one, two, three, four and. The G, one and two, three, four and. The D sus four, one and two, three, four and. And then the A, one and two and three and four and. And that gives you the intro and the verse. Let's get into the pre-chorus of the song. So guys, for the pre-chorus, you are going to need a few extra chords. We have a C chord in there, but just like the G, it is varied. So for the C chord we're going to use, I'm going to call it C add nine. I want you to go into the G chord we did before. So that full G. Now for this, all you do is move your first finger down a string and your second finger down a string. So right now, they're on A and E. So we're gonna bring them down to D and A. So we're on D, A. And then those two little fingers are staying on B and D as well. So this is gonna be our C add nine. Now we're changing our strumming as well to a B, to B modern style strumming pattern. So it goes down, pause, down, down, up. That's gonna be your C add nine for strumming. Down, pause, down, down, up. Then you are into a D sus4 just like before. Down, pause, down, down, up. And then an E minor add nine, just like the very start of the song. The E minor with these two little fingers added on as well. And that does the full four beats. Down, pause, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up. That whole line is played again, so it starts off in that C add nine. Down, pause, down, down, up. Your D sus4, down, pause, down, down, up. And then your E minor add nine. Down, pause, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up. And that is the first line, uh, or the first two lines, because it's played twice of the pre-chorus. The next line starts the same, it does your C add 9 and your D sus 4. It goes down, pause, down, down, up. D sus 4, down, pause, down, down, up. Now, the next four chords are one beat each. It's a down, down, up, but it's very quick. It's one beat. So each chord goes one, two, three, four. There's your four beats, four chords are to be played in that timing. So the chords are G, 
D, E minor, and G, E doing down, down, up. So it goes G, down, up, D, down, up, E, down, up, G, down, up. Then we go into our A sus4, just like in the verse, you can either do it with two fingers or one finger by removing that middle finger. And we have the A sus4 is played twice, each with four beats. So it goes down, pause, down, down, up, up, down, one, two, three, four. And again, down, pause, down, down, up, up, down, one, two, three, four. So that is the pre-chorus of the song. The whole pre-chorus should sound like this when you play it. to blast into the chorus of the song. Right guys, finally we have the chorus and we are gonna start with a C add nine, just like the first chord in that pre-chorus. So you start off with all four fingers on, your first finger is on D number two, then in that third box you have your A string, your B string, and your E string. And the strumming is the exact same as the verse that we did. So the first chord does one, two, three, four, and. So that down up at the end is faster. It goes one, two, three, four, and. Then you are into that E minor add nine. So your little two fingers stay where they are and your first two fingers go into an E minor shape, which is second box A and D. And it switches to one and, two, three, four and. So the first strum now becomes faster. One and two, three, four and. G add nine or a full G. One and two, three, four and. Then back into that E minor shape and you're going down up four times. One and two and three and four and. And that's the chorus, it's played four times for every chorus. So we have the C add nine starting off. One, two, three, four, and. E minor, one and two, three, four, and. G, one and two, three, four, and. E minor, one and two, and three, and four, and. And that is how you play the chorus. So guys, the way the song is laid out, it has an intro, which is just your verse played two times. Then it has a full verse, which is the verse line four times, another verse, verse line four times, full pre-chorus, and then chorus four times, then it stops. Then you can um, go straight into the verse if you like, or you can do a little bit of strumming in um, uh, G add nine. Um, just to bring you back into the next verse. And then there's four lines of a verse, a full pre-chorus, and then the chorus is played twice. So you're gonna play that chorus line eight times instead of four times. And then it does the outro where it just continuously plays that chorus over and over and over again. And how long you want to play that is up to you, how long you want to run it out. Now usually when I do perform it, I don't do two full choruses at the end. I do in my cover here at the end of this video just to show you uh, the full song and the performance piece. But when I'm playing it live, I only do one chorus at the end and then I do the outro straight after because it is fairly um, long or I'll run this into another song and keep that buzz going. But guys, that is it from me here today. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought of today's video. Like it if you liked it. Subscribe if you are new. And guys, I will see you next time. Today is gonna be the day that they're gonna throw it back to you By now you should have somehow realized what you gotta do Cause I don't believe that anybody feels the way I do about you now Back beat the word is on the street that the fire in your heart is out I'm sure you've heard it all before and you never really had a doubt Cause I don't believe that anybody feels the way I do about you now And all the roads we had to take were winding And all the lights that guide us there were blinding There are many things that I would like to say to you, but I don't know how Said I don't know how Because maybe 
you're gonna be the one that saves me And after all You're my wonderful Today is gonna be the day that you're gonna throw it back to you By now you should have somehow realized what you're not to do Cause I don't believe that anybody feels the way I do about you now And all the roads we had to take were winding And all the lights that guide the way were blinding Oh, there are many things that I would like to say to you But I don't know how Be the one.